Well, keeping with football, but heading over to the college field, SIU had its biggest game of the season so far yesterday. The number 12 ranked Salukis welcomed number one South Dakota State to Carbondale. It was a showdown of two heavyweights, but the Jackrabbits came out on top. 12,000 fans were in attendance for the big Missouri Valley Conference showdown. It was homecoming. There was a pregame flyover. And before the game, the 1983 championship team and their coach Ray Dempsey were honored. As for the action on the field, it was a slow offensive start for both teams. The game was scoreless for the first 27 minutes. SDSU found the end zone first late in the second half following an interception from Saluki quarterback Nick Baker. They scored again early in the third quarter to go up 14-0. The Salukis found the end zone for the first and only time early in the fourth quarter thanks to a 24-yard score from Deontay Cox who returned from an injury this week. But it was just too little too late for Southern. South Dakota State went on to win its 20 First straight game, 17 to 10 over SIU. Despite the loss, quarterback Nick Baker says the team is still confident. I mean, regardless of what goes on out there, we're going to be a confident group, and this team is different. We're never going to point fingers, and we're just going to keep working and try to be the best we can be. But yeah, it does give you, man. Man, we were right there, and we left stuff on the board. And but no, this team's different. We're never going to point fingers, regardless of what happens out there. So the Salukis will look to bounce back on the road next Saturday. They'll travel to Macomb to face a winless Western Illinois team. Kickoff for that game is set for three.